All right, today I'm gonna to be reviewing something a little different. Uh, I usually just review fishing equipment or workout equipment, but saw these advertised on uh, probably Instagram or something, I think. And I was like, man, those look super badass. I gotta get those. So these are from a company called Hakai Culture. And uh, I, I believe it's Chinese. The package said Illinois, I think, but I think they are made in China. So uh, they look really sweet. I was like, man, I gotta get those, I gotta try those. But I was a little nervous because uh, maybe the quality is not so good uh, or maybe, well, they're $37 after shipping. So they're not real expensive, but I also don't wanna throw, throw away $40 on something that is either not gonna be high quality or sometimes these things are sized in Asian sizes. So they're really hard to tell. So they offer five inch and seven inch inseams and uh, these are medium. So uh, I'm 5'10", 180. I wear 32, 32 jeans. I wear medium in all other uh, shorts or, or any like sweatpants, whatever like that for men, medium size. So I wanted to go with a medium five inch and I'm super glad I did. These things fit extremely well uh, the five inch inseam I really like. I really like shorts that come, you know, a couple inches above the knee. So you're not like kind of getting your knees caught up in them when you're doing stuff, especially for athletic shorts. So uh, the seven inches, depending on your leg length, would probably come close to the top of the knee. And these give you probably like three inches above the knee. I will put them on a try them in a second. But <clears throat> uh, very impressed with these. And I do think they are true to size. Um, they're pretty elastic. so. Uh, even if you're a little bit thicker person and I, I, I do a decent amount of workouts and uh, lunges, squats, deadlifts, things like that. So I do have kind of beefier thighs and these are still fit really well. I have some other medium five inch inseam shorts that are really tight around the thigh and uh, butt region. So these ones actually fit quite well. And uh, I think the picture of them might make them look just a little bit more kind of glossy and badass but they are still really freaking cool looking and they do got two little pockets here they're not super deep or anything but they'd be enough to fit your keys or phone or something like that if you got a smaller cell phone uh so yeah overall very impressed with these a lot of times you see stuff like this and they don't really live up to the hype but these things are awesome uh they seem to be well constructed the material's nice uh, the stitching on them all seems nice. So um, I'll try them on right now and then I'll just show you guys what they look like. All right, so you can see, you know, I got maybe four inches above the kneecap or so. Uh, definitely enough to show off some legs, uh, but not just egregiously uh, high and you know ridiculous looking you know they still look good they still look athletic uh, they don't like have any points where they feel tight or restrictive pockets are deep enough or good enough I don't really like huge pockets on shorts either because they might come out of the bottom or you know if you could fit big stuff in them, they just look goofy so they're good size but not too huge and uh, I'm not a giant Pokemon nerd, but you know, I played all the video games on Game Boy and stuff back in the day. Played Pokemon Snap on 64, so that's some OG stuff for you right there. But uh, yeah, Gengar definitely looks badass. The purple and all the colors on it look pretty good. The fit is great, especially, you know, if you work out a little, you got uh, some quads you wanna show off. Definitely awesome shorts. They got some other anime stuff and just some other random designs too, but I think these ones are by far the coolest. You guys might think differently, uh, but yeah, definitely good fit. Uh, they are true to American size. They're not some of these Asian sizes where you need to get like a 4XL to equal a medium in American sizes. So um, very awesome shorts. I'm very uh, impressed with them initially. I haven't washed them yet, but you know, I'll probably wash them in cold water and then just kind of hang dry them. But uh, they definitely seem to be well made and worth the money and they look just absolutely badass. So uh, if you're on the fence, if you're unsure, I would say 
the uh, $37, $38, whatever it is that for shipping, definitely worth it. Definitely eye-popping, catching shorts, and they definitely look good. So, hope you guys enjoy this review, and if you're on the fence, hopefully this kind of made you made your decision easier if you want to spend the $40 on these shorts. So thanks for watching this guys. See you in the next video.